I'm analyzing the Void Paradox. You succeeded in intercepting the Executioner. An extraordinary display of skill. If there was a descendant like you a century ago, I'm certain we would have been able to stop the Apocalypse. There are no what-ifs in history, of course. But the Apocalypse has left such a deep wound on humanity. Regardless, if we allow ourselves to ponder all of the what-ifs, perhaps things would be better if the Iron Hearts had never existed in this world. Every time an Iron Heart is uncovered, it's as if the Colossi are awoken and head to Ingress. But ironically, we also need the Iron Hearts to stop the Colossi. It is one of the great paradoxes. Descendant, perhaps this is exactly why the Ancestors sealed the Iron Hearts in vaults. I'm beginning to suspect that perhaps the Ancestors hid the Iron Hearts away to prevent history repeating itself. We will need extensive preparation for the moment when the third Iron Heart is revealed. Hmm. There is much that I would like to discuss with you, and also with the entity known as the Guide, if possible. However, we do not have the luxury of time right now. HQ is urgently looking for you, Descendant. You should make your way there as quickly as possible. Descendant, thanks to you, the stability of my system was restored. However, the Iron Heart has slipped from our grasp. While you were stopping the Colossus, I delivered the necessary information to Enzo. It is likely that HQ will be preparing countermeasures. Got a question about the operation? Ah, Descendant. You're here. Thank you for all your hard work with the Intercept battle. Unfortunately, we need to drag you into another operation before you get a chance to rest. Albion has entered uncharted territory. A descendant has committed treason. A descendant. Someone who should have been humanity's beacon of hope. Damn it! How could this have happened? HQ has officially denounced Jeremy as a traitor. A rapid arrest operation is in progress. Enzo received intel from the guide and was first on the scene. Jeremy is heading towards Echo Swamp. As the enemy's attention is keenly focused on this location and because of the swampy terrain, deployment of forces on a large scale will be difficult. To make matters worse, we've lost contact with Esimo. He was carrying out another operation in the area. Esimo's support was vital. Enzo won't be able to command and fight by himself. Our lack of manpower is delaying the operation. If we don't hurry, we'll be delivering the Ironheart to the Vulgus on a silver platter after we worked so hard to get it. We must prevent that from happening at all costs. Rules of engagement for Jeremy will be sent separately. If possible, I would like to have him brought back alive. I want to hear what he was thinking as his commander, and why he did what he did. Go after Jeremy, and please, find the Ironheart and bring it back. I will tell Enzo to prepare to resume the operation. Understood. Descendant, wrap up any preparations for reinforcements quickly, and head to the Misty Woods outpost in Echo Swamp. Enzo is awaiting your arrival. To hunt down Jeremy. I've sent number 17 of the Kolong Special Forces to help with tracking Jeremy. Get the sit rep from Enzo and carry out the operation. This operation must succeed. All right, we've had some delays, but I'm happy to say we can now restart the pursuit. First things first, as we've lost contact with Esimo, there are no other descendants who have the power to handle the battle. We had to suspend the search and blockade construction. I'm afraid we'll need a rescue operation for Esimo. He was deployed here on a mission to destroy a Vulgus facility, and we've lost contact with his unit. If possible, I think searching for Esimo while we continue with the rest of the mission is a good idea. While our operation was delayed, 
The fog has deployed their forces throughout the swamp. We think they sensed something was up with Jeremy. I got impatient, so I took command and attacked. But because the soldiers couldn't receive their orders in time, we nearly experienced heavy losses. After that, Volga's forces increased and rapid deployment of soldiers wasn't feasible. It seems Jeremy used this to his advantage and went deeper into the swamp. So starting now, we'll be focusing on reconnaissance to expand the search area. If you go on ahead, the soldiers will follow and establish a barricade. This will allow for much wider RK distribution, which will be an advantage in tracking both Jeremy's RK and the Iron Heart traces. We have to overextend ourselves a little. We have no choice. Based on the intel from the guide, it's clear Jeremy has some kind of plan in mind. Apparently Jeremy's voice was captured through the Iron Heart pulse. However, briefly that was detected. This is what was recorded. I knew it, I was right. The Volgas here have all been enhanced through superior DNA. The quality of this Kuiper is perfect. Though it would have been good to secure both DNA and Kuiper in advance. Oh yeah. You heard him, right? DNA, Kuiper. I have no idea what he's talking about, but I know this operation needs to resume quickly. The area where the guide picked up Jeremy's voice is a way off. We've got a long road ahead of us. Us. This operation, we're all slowly sinking into this swamp. I'm not happy about it. Be prepared for unexpected combat situations. I leave the mission in your capable hands.
invisible enemy has appeared. You should focus on the battle for now. Jeremy to HQ. If they have any new intel, they'll send it to us. <laughs> 